Would, would you say you are good at letting go? Of people? Well, just or... well yes, that too, of course. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, but just, are you, are you, do you have that side go. as well, or are you just in control all the time? Um, yeah, I let go. I, I like to have fun, and I like to be happy, and I like to have a level of spontaneity in my life, and just go off on a whim here, and that's, that's the part of my brain that's, that's an artist, and then there's the part of my brain that also understands that there's like a harsh reality to every single one of my actions. So those two are fighting all the time too. Those two are like, you know, like take a road trip, have fun, go dancing on top of- Lights, camera, fake relationships, smell, at least. That is what one corner of the internet is suggesting. The relationship that launched a million of memes between Travis Kelsey and Taylor Swift suddenly seemed to be under threat after a document alleging to be from one of Kelsey's agents circulated on social media claiming the couple is headed for a breakup. But it now appears or seems to be an elaborate prank. Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey went public with their relationship in 2023 last year. Their first public outing was on September 24th, that same year when Swift attended Kelsey's Kansas City Chiefs game. They've been going on strong scenes, with Kelsey and his brother and sister-in-law Jason and Kylie Kelsey attending Swift performances and showing support for Swift's most recent album, The Tortured Poet Department. Travis also attended Swift Era Store concert. Now here comes the bomb. A document titled Comprehensive Media Plan for Travis Kelsey's Public Relation following breakup with Taylor Swift by Full School PR started to go viral on Reddit before spreading on other social media platforms early this week. The document says Kelsey's team plans to release an official statement announcing the separation of Travis Kelsey and Taylor Swift on the 28th of September three days post breakup to allow initial media frenzy to settle and ensure clarity. So in essence, what does this mean? The pair were apparently supposed to announce their separation on the 28th of September. Coincidentally, 28th September is around the first NFL game of the season and it's also national beer drinking day. So that makes a good date night for sure. What then did the alleged contract say about Travis Kelsey and Taylor Swift's relationship? The supposed plan outlines how Kelsey would effectively manage and mitigate fallout from a breakup with this mega superstar. It says that a breakup would occur in 28 September and details how Kelsey's team should proceed with messaging and press in the aftermath. The plan also identifies media outlets for Kelsey to be interviewed by, like ESPN, People's Magazine, and Vanity Fair. It also includes taking points like emphasizing his respect for Taylor Swift and the mutual decision to part ways. Fosco PR, however, says nobody that works for the agency had anything to do with the document and the company's legal team is investigating who illegally used the agency's logo and posed as a member of a firm. The original Reddit page sharing the post has since been taken down. This whole stage relationship thing has been causing mixed reactions by fans and they are certainly not buying it at all. Fans have pointed out the document's vague language. It one fan comparing it to a high school assignment, others suggesting it was drafted by ChatGBT. Another fan commented, look, I'm still convinced the pair got together for PR, but if you think the machine that is behind Taylor Swift would ever let a PR contract see the light of the day, you are living in a fantasy world. I still don't buy the couple, but I don't buy this story contract making the rounds either. Well, according to a source, Taylor Swift was unbothered and quite amused by this. She usually pays these things no mind at all, but this was some hilarious AI realness. It isn't even what an actual reaction from her or her team. She and Travis had a good laugh over it and his camp only got lawyers involved because 
it is his PRU firm listed on the document. Now, there's what you all should know. Kelsey's publicist, Ketsoyan, has previously admitted to arranging showmances, aka fake romances, for publicity for celebrities. Ketsoyan said this in 2019 interview that the practice is common to help hype a celebrity. So fans, is the whole relationship thing staged? It's hard to say cause for nearly a year now, fans on the internet in general have gone back and forth debating on the legitimacy of Swift and Kelsey's relationship. The thing is, we can only tell come 28 September. Stay tuned.